Oh, excuse you. All right. Time to get rid of that fiery breath before you get a bellyache. Winnie, don't take him away for too long. You know the red dragon gets agitated when the baby's away from her. I know, I know. Jeez, you sound like mother. Hey, sorry. Just careful with the little guy, okay? This little fellow always comes and keeps us company at the hideout. Apart from me and Hans, he's the only other one that knows where it is. So no telling, got it? Here we go. Let's get all that nasty fire breath out now. There you go. Get it all out. Is that really necessary, Winfrieda? It's already getting too hot in here. Weren't you the one saying it was a little chilly before? Well, fine. But at least open some windows to keep the room from becoming a furnace, please. Let's get you back to the hideout before Hans gets upset with us. There, safe and sound. And free to leave, little guy. Uh, or not. As you please. Hey, Hans. Oh, hey, hey, Winnie. What's up? Hey, I can help you with your test through the window. All sneaky-like. Let's go practice your test. Oh, okay. So you have something ready to, to help me? Uh, sure. Sure. All right then, Hans. Whenever you're ready. Um, uh, um, uh, disappear us? D disappear me? No, wait. Fee, fi, uh, wait, wait. Hans. Are you sure you're ready to practice? Uh, well, no. I'm, I'm afraid not, Mrs. Vogt. I'm sorry. Never mind, Hans. Come back when you feel more ready, okay? Uh, sorry, Hans. Guess I'm not much help after all. Oh, don't worry, Winnie. We'll, we'll get it next time. opens the shed by the school, with all the neat gardening stuff inside. Not that anyone uses it much since... since father didn't come back. Oh, I finally did it. I'm in... the shed. Hmm, this isn't as cool as I thought it would be. Less shiny, interesting toys, more... dust and rusty tools. Ah, gardening gloves. Quite a bit larger than my hands, but they'll do. Oh! Le ah! Gardening gloves! So this is that dry ice stuff Hans was talking about. I wonder if it will really make as much fog when added to water as he says it will. Hey, ya Hans. Oh, hey, hey, Winnie. What's up? Hey, let's go practice your... Oh, okay. Uh, sure. All right then, Hans. Whenever you're ready. Um, uh... Um, uh... Okay, moment of truth. Hope my aim is good. Oh my, w what what was that? That was quite an unusual method, but quite effective, I must admit. How did you do that? Science! Uh... In... Science! Tell her it was science! It, it was just... just... 
practice, Mrs. Vogt, like you said. What? Well done, Hans. You have indeed passed. You should be proud. What the heck, Hans? Oh, hi, Winnie. That worked wonderfully. With the tea being hot, the sublimation happened even quicker than I calculated. Why didn't you just tell her how you did it? She's always telling us we're wasting our time, putting us in detention. Just when she was impressed, we could have shown her she's wrong. I, I got the spell book, though, Winnie. Isn't that enough? Um, no. She, she has to know. She can't always bully us around. She does care about you, Winnie. What about you? The stuff in here you've made? This isn't a waste. This has potential. It... it has things even witches can use. And learn from, too. But it... it was a test for witchcraft. I... I would have failed. And not just that, Winnie. Mrs. Volk's whole life is dedicated to witchcraft. And people need time to accept changes like that. Don't you see? No, I don't see. Your experiments deserve attention. Not like this, okay? If we want other people to be patient and understanding, then we need to be patient and understanding, too. Okay, Winnie? Ah, oh, fine. For now. They'll see eventually. But, but good work. On getting the book and stuff. <laughs> you too, Winnie. We made quite a team, huh? Uh, sure. Whatever. I'm going to go find stuff. But, but, but Winnie... Wait, that means now we have everything. We have it all now. Wait, you mean the incantation? Let's do it. Then the candles go here and here. Right, that's good. Okay, good. Now just read from this bit here, Winnie. Me? Why me? You say it. Winnie. All right, fine. Give it here. Ahem. O oh, great and all-knowing goddess, come to me. Here is the place and time for thee. I wish to open the eye of three. O oh, great and powerful Minerva, allow me to see. That's it, Winnie. It's working. Uh, g gift me with your sight and awareness. Open to me my knowing within. Make others' thoughts clear. So it is plain what is mine and what is theirs. So, so mote it be. Enough. You who will toy with the spirit. You who bring suffering and pain. Me? Suffering and pain? Audi alterum partem. The path is already writ. The girl with the third eye watches, but it is too late. Too late. Third eye? What girl? Me? Not for you. Never for you. The stones will not work. Only for her. Where the girl's eyes are open, yours are forever closed. But my test! I need them! Your soul too far corrupted. The third eye girl will empower the dark. You should never have sought to steal her spirit. Steal the spirit? N no my machine... The devil's hand closes in to beget a life of evil. Well, what are you talking about? Hans, what is she talking about? Winnie. So much hate. So much sorrow. So much death. No, stop! P -p -p please Life will be gone. She cannot rejuvenate. Only understand. The word is irrevocably woven, but the pattern is incomplete. Wait, weird? Already woven? Now, in the falling of dusk, the Owl of Minerva spreads its wings. Late as it may be, seek the Third Eye Girl, who intends to remove you. Remove me? A girl removing me? Janneke! 
Reject her hand, and there is no hope for you. Take her hand. Take it. Let it end. Let it end. Let it end. Huh? I... I don't understand. My third eye can't be opened? Winnie, this is bad. I know it's bad. My test. No, Winnie. If I can't get this telecaminos, then... Then... Then what am I going to do now? Maybe... Maybe we should stop now, Winnie. Yes. That's it. That's what I have to do. I should have done it from the beginning. Wait, you... You don't mean... I have to get it. I have to get the amber orb. Winnie, no! The vice of Frauen. It's nonsense. I'm not failing this. I'm going to prove them all wrong. Mother, Yannicka, all of them. Well, Winnie, if something happens to you... Don't you see? I'm out of time. This, this is our weird we're talking about. This is my life. I don't want to have a bad fate given to me, Hans. I, I know, Winnie. I'm, I'm just saying that if something happens to you... It has to be her. She's the only one who has seen it. If she won't tell me where it is, then I'll just... I'll make her show me. But if something happens to you, Winnie, then I'll be... be, be all alone again. <laughs>